Okay, good morning, everybody. Uh, the Eagles, of course, lost yesterday 33-30 to in the last seconds to the San Diego Chargers. And you could blame a lot of people. I thought that offense played well, but not quite well enough. Uh, they left points on the board. Uh, the clock wasn't managed well at the end of the game. The defense was horrible, okay? That's being nice. Uh, the Offensively, of course, they moved the ball, and, and really, you know, Michael Vick, Vick had a big day. Uh, and they scored 30 points, but it could have easily been 40, 45, up near 50 points they could have scored if they had taken advantage of all their opportunities. Deshaun Jackson was open all day, especially the deep routes. Uh, he and Michael Vick were only able to connect twice. Once a, one of those was called back, thanks to a uh, penalty on Lane Johnson. Uh, there were five times he got deep. Uh, they connected twice. Uh, one time, uh, you could blame it on uh, Vic in the throw, and you could blame it on Deshaun being too close to the out-of-bound line, and uh, he was ruled out of bounds. And then you had a time where he was overthrown. Vic had, had uh, some pressure on him from Dwight Freeney as, uh, you know, he ran that, uh, that, that spin move on Lane Johnson, got some pressure on Michael Vic. Uh, another time, that was when he was overthrown. Another time, Vic put it right on Deshaun's hands. It would have been a tough catch, but it was a catchable ball, a ball that should have been caught. So you had five times that he got deep. They were able to connect on one that counted only once. He still caught nine passes for 193 yards, which is a great day, but it could have been 300 yards. And with as bad as the defense was playing, they needed every bit of it. Defensively, horrible game. Just horrible. Uh, they... Put no pressure on uh, Philip Rivers. Uh, he was able to stay back there. He was comfortable most of the day. He was hit one time, basically, and that was the sack for Connor Barwin, who just ran over a fluke over there on the uh, right side. Just flat out ran over him. Uh, other than that, it was a comfortable day for Philip Rivers in the pocket. He got rid of the ball quickly. And, you know, Michael Kendricks was no matchup for Antonio Gates, uh, Nate Allen was beaten time and time and time again. Uh, they needed to change things up. Uh, when they did change things up, they, they did, weren't able to disguise the coverages, and Philip Rivers took his time and was able to decipher what they were in. So not a good day for the Birds. At the end, Chip Kelly probably uh, near the two-minute warning. He should have let it go to the two-minute warning. Everybody should have relaxed. They should have tried to take as much time off the clock as they could have uh, before they were trying to score, while they were trying to score. All in all, the San Diego Chargers could have scored a touchdown if they'd have wanted it. So the defense wasn't up to it, and they were the main reason they lost. Uh, but the offense, they got to play better when the defense is stinking up the place like they were.